what's going on my friend welcome to the channel and thank you for watching this is my premier league match week six preview and everything is gonna start this weekend on saturday but before we go any further you know what to do help your brother out subscribe to the channel like the video comment down below share take one second to help with YouTube algorithm and it will be much appreciated. Here we go. Let me remind you the table so far after five games. Manchester City, top of the table, 13 point. Liverpool, second, 12 point. Aston Villa, third, 12 point. Arsenal, fourth, 11 point. Chelsea, fifth, 10 point Newcastle United are sixth 10 point right on seven Nottingham Forest eighth Fulham ninth Tottenham Hospers 10th Manchester United are 11 Brentford are 12 Bournemouth 13 West Ham 14 Leicester City 15 Crystal Palace 16 17th Ipswich Town with 3 point 18th Southampton with only 1 point Everton are 19th 1 point and the bottom of the table 20th Wolves with only 1 point Take your time with it take your time with it Very quickly, let's talk about the games this weekend. Saturday, September the 28th, 2024. Very early in the morning, if you are in the US, 7.30 a.m. Eastern Time, probably 4.30 Pacific Time. Newcastle United against Manchester City. It's going to be a tough game. City and Arsenal drew the last game in the Premier League and Newcastle United lost against Fulham 3-1 very tough game but Manchester City regardless of Rodri missing and De Bruyne missing I think they have enough power to beat Newcastle away 2-1 Arsenal against Leicester City the last game in the Premier League Manchester City and Arsenal drew 2-2 Leicester City drew against Everton 1-1. Arsenal playing home. They just had a very good game in the Carabao Cup. They won 5-1 against Bolton. Arsenal are going to be too strong for Leicester City. 3-0 to Arsenal. Brentford against West Ham. London Derby. Listen, West Ham need to start winning games. Otherwise, the manager is going to get sacked. The last game, they, they got smashed by Chelsea at home. West Ham. 3-0 and Brentford lost against Tottenham in another London derby 3-1. Both of them need point. But most importantly, West Ham United are under pressure. I think it's going to be a draw 2-2. Ah! You idiots! What are we doing, man? Chelsea against Brighton, Stamford Bridge, 10 o'clock a.m. Eastern time. I'm gonna make an entire video about this game, so we're not gonna waste our time here. The last game in the Premier League, Chelsea beat West Ham 3 0. Brentford drew against Nottingham Forest 2 2. Brentford haven't lost any game in the Premier League this season. Three draws with two wins. But I think this is gonna be their first loss in the premier league chelsea three brighton one everton against crystal palace this one is gonna be a tough game everton need point crystal palace need point the last game in the premier league manchester united drew 0-0 against palace away leicester city drew against everton 1-1 Two teams that need point. 
Everton playing home, Sean Dyche is going to do everything in his power to win this game. And I think they're going to do it 2-1 to Everton. Nottingham Forest against Fulham. Brighton and Nottingham Forest 2-2, the last game in the Premier League. Fulham destroyed Newcastle 3-1, the last game in the Premier League. Forest playing home. Fulham are in good form at the moment. But I'm afraid this game is going to be a 1-1 draw. Wolves against Liverpool. Wolves need to win. They are bottom of the table. O'Neill is under pressure. His attitude is changing. Completely different team that, than less, uh, last season. They sold few players, few, few key key players. So they are not doing good this season. Liverpool, they won the last game in the Premier League against Bournemouth 3-0. Aston Villa beat Wolves. Yeah, I'm afraid Liverpool are going to just go away and do it. 1-0. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Already! Already! 30 seconds! And then we move to the games on Sunday, September the 29th, 2024. We're going to start by... Ipswich against Aston Villa, but Aston Villa are too strong, and I'm afraid Ipswich to lose at home 2 1 to Aston Villa. The same uh, Sunday, Manchester United against Spurs. What a game at Old Trafford. Eric Ten Hag is under pressure. After drop drawing against 20 in the Conference League. And the last game in the Premier League, they didn't even win 0-0. Tottenham Hotspurs are, are doing good because they beat Brentford. The last game in the Premier League, 3-1. And they also won in the Carabao Cup. So they are confident. Oh man, this game is going to be a very tough game. But it's going to be a 2-2 draw. Wasn't the problem with club ball the fact that we always concede at the start? We always concede before we score. Club ball, meh, 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 meh. Let's now talk about the last game of match week six. It's going to be on Monday, September the 30th, 2024. Bournemouth against Southampton. Southampton are very low in confidence now. They have to win this game, but unfortunately, they are not going to win. Bournemouth are going to win this game at home 